Hello and welcome to my channel. Thank you for joining me. Today I'm doing the favorites of March. I know I'm a little late for March, but that's just how it goes when you get busy and you have kids. So thank you for joining me. Please subscribe to my channel to be part of the family. I would love it if you would join and um, leave your comments. I love seeing um, people's comments. So um, without further ado, I will get started. I don't have my executive assistant today, my son Lucas. He has uh, soccer, so it's really, really cute when they play soccer. I had three-year-olds to understand the concept of the game. It's a little bit difficult, but they're so cute. So he's uh, at soccer practice right now. So um, today um, it'll be just me. So first of all, I want to go through kind of um, tools. There, it's interesting that um, for a long time I was using the same eyelash curler that I've always used for probably 15 years. It's interesting that we tend to splurge on our makeup but not think about the items that we use every single day and I I mean you use your eyelash curler every single day and I had this really old really um, cheap junky eyelash curler before and I bought this one probably a couple years maybe a, a year back or something like that um, and I was using this other one and you know how if it's a bad curler that you get the the eyelashes and they're kind of um, dented well that's what it was and and not thinking about it and then I was like why am I using this curler so I started researching and <clears throat> I found this curler on Sephora and a lot of reviews of were really really good on it you think an eyelash curler is an eyelash curler but it's really different this is the Surat S-U-R-R-A-T. Um, it's really, really good. It doesn't pinch your eyelashes and it doesn't create that dent like you have in a lot of them. So something that you, as basic as an eyelash curler that you use every single day that you really want a product that really, really works for you. So I really, really like this um, when I got it about a year back. So I've really, really enjoyed it. <clears throat> next, pro uh, next product that I would like to um, talk about is face products. There are two masks that I really really love right now. The first one is from Fresh, the company Fresh. It's the Vitamin Nectar Vibrancy Boosting Face Mask. It's really really amazing. I love this um, and this smells so so good. It's nectar and it just smells amazing on your skin. It does like my sister pointed out, it does kind of feel like you're putting jam on your face, but it just leaves the skin so refreshed, so um, filled with moisture. It's just really, really nice. Uh, this one you leave on for 10 minutes and then you can take off. So this is really, really, I really, really love this um, mask. My sister got the, um, the, the moisturizer, the face moisturizer with this, so she says it's really, really good as well, but I really love the mask. The other mask that I really, really love, and this is a leave-on mask. This is a La Mer. It's the, the lifting and firming mask. It is amazing. I don't know what it does, but it almost, it feels like you have brand new skin the next morning. It's a leave-on mask that you massage in circular motions all over your face and then leave on the skin to um, sleep overnight. But it just gives you so much moisture and it brightens your skin. It's amazing. You have to try it to believe it. Like I didn't un understand what was going on, but it it is really, really amazing. I would highly recommend for a, a mask that you leave on the skin, this is amazing. Very, very good. <clears throat> the other product that I would like to talk about is my, of course, Chanel Obsession, my Chanel Quad. And it was interesting because this quad, you know how you usually go through your makeup and look through all your makeup and see what do you have, kind of take another browse at your makeup. And this one was one that I had kind of left off and thought it was a one of those purchases that really wasn't worth it. But then I took another second look at it and I tried it again and the way that I was applying it was probably not the best way to apply. I didn't do a very good job of putting my base eyeshadow color and then putting this on to blend it. So then I kind of worked with it and tried it again and it is beautiful. Like the reason why I bought it is as you can see this gold. I love this gold. The best way to put this gold is pretty much with your finger. It's the best way to put it on. So, but it is just beautiful colors. I really, really have 
fallen kind of back in love with this palette. This is the Chanel Quad and it's in the color Signe Particular. I really, really, really like this. It has the smoky, smoky, like purplish gray and then the purplish tone and then this gold is just amazing to put all over your lid. It's really, really pretty. So I really have liked this. So case in point, go through your makeup, try it, give it another look, and maybe you might fall in love with something that you didn't originally think. The other product that I tried this last month was I knew that there was a ton of hype with the Anastasia Brow Wiz, and I heard a lot about it, and I really wanted to try it, and I really, really loved it. It's the... I love that it has this brush on the end. It's so easy and convenient because you have the pencil and then you have the brow brush right there. And then the point is so, so fine that it just makes the beautiful little streaks on your um, brow. It's just really, really a good product. I definitely worth the hype in my opinion because this is my this was my first time trying it. So definitely worth the hype. The last product I'd like to talk about is a little bit absurdly expensive. It's Chanel, of course, but um, I tried this product first when the, I went to Nordstrom for their beauty event, and they put it on, and my skin just felt so refreshed and very um, glowy that I just, I was blown away by this. So I bought this and it is amazing. So this comes in, it's a beautiful um, package. I do kind of wish that it was in a pump because for every day you can't really use because you have to take it out, put it on your skin. I don't, it's just not convenient for every day. Uh, but it comes with this a foundation with this little spatula to pick up the product. And of course it has the Chanel sign. And then uh, the brush, it does come with a brush. I don't really use this brush, but you can. I find it to be a little bit small. I like a little bit bigger brushes, personally, um, but it does come with a brush and it's super, super soft. So it's really, really nice. But this is the foundation. Um, it is a little pricier, but it's part of their sublimage line. They do have um, the sublimage face creams. They're absurdly expensive, but it has the vanilla, Planifolia, vanilla planifolia in it. It's this special uh, vitamin enriched uh, plant that they put in their line, sublimage line. But this is their first product that ha actually has diamond powder in it. So it leaves the skin beautiful, healthy looking, and it's almost like a glow within. It's just, it's amazing. So if anything, just try it out just to get a, a little sample and um, see if it's for you. It is expensive, but it is definitely beautiful. It's light to medium, which is what I like. I don't like the heavy, heavy, cakey makeup, but this is just the perfect um, light and it's the perfect uh, glowy skin that I want. So it does come with a brush and everything. So I think, um, but it is it is very, very beautiful. For me, it is worth, worth the investment for this because it, it makes your skin look so beautiful. So that is it. That is my favorites of March. I hope you enjoyed it. There's a lot of products that I've really been enjoying this last month that I, I wanted to um, share with all of you. So please, if you like my channel, please subscribe. And of course, hit that bell button to get notified of uh, my videos. It's not a lot, but um, I do love to share my favorites and what I think of uh, products. There's a lot out there and it's very, very uh, overwhelming. So I do love to share the things that I, I like and the reasons why so and I hope you, you like them as well uh, let me know what you think uh, of these products if you've ever tried them and what your pro favorite products are so all right thank you for joining me bye